day seven of the dead memo tournament and the final day before you know the multi-stage and the final hour the 1v1s all that good stuff we can see right here i'm trying to buy an aram skirt for like seven mil gp and the guy won't accept it it shows how expensive these items are getting everyone wants the perfect you know gear set up and everything but yeah either way we got a lot of gains to make today so let's win this 20k probably not currently finishing the ib demon task from the last video and yeah 94 strength 89 attack 114.5 combat level 94 hp one more level to that big milestone i probably will end up getting 95s just spread throughout the board instead of getting like 99 strength and then having a few other stats be 90 you know i'll just have them be very even 89 defense and the task complete let's go hit up neve and see what we get 174 abbey demons I actually did get a calfi task and skip it so this is basically a back-to-back -back. oh yeah look at this guy getting pk'd over here that could have been me man i wasn't even paying attention to i was afk in the last like minute and i come back to this Ooh, sketchy okay it looks like the other girl over there training slayer is actually with the pk and helping uh you know take the aggro off this guy could die i mean he could get away as well it's not that far away you just go up and down the ladder and teleport after like you know five seconds or whatever but um yeah he just has peapots and monks robes he's been getting worked on level 86 slayer achieved right there yet another emblem tier five man i'm getting so lucky today with these no way another tier five <laughs> quite the milestone right there 95 strength i probably won't get 99 to be honest Although I could if I just slaved away for the next, like, you know, five hours, but I'm not sure. Oh, uh, yeah, there it is. A whip drop. Feeling good. Whips are still, like, 1.3 mil or something, although they aren't as valuable as they were a couple days ago because people aren't really training that much. They're trying to do, like, barrels and whatnot, and so many whips are in the game because the drop rate is increased uh, fairly heavily. Another whip drop. Let's go. No way. The third whip in, like, 100 kills. Oh, this luck right here. Level 90 attack right there. No, Miss Hyatt. Yo, did she just get BS by the clan? Yet another tier five. This is probably like our seventh or eighth uh, tier five this tournament so far. Level 91 attack. Just hit a very big milestone right there. 95 HP, getting a lot of levels. One day left exactly until the tournament ends, like 24 hours. So, you know, I'm trying to grind as much as I can. And uh, this is a great task. No way, another tier five. I'll probably um sell all these, you know, tier fives for points and then buy a whole bunch of brews because brews are starting to skyrocket because everyone needs them for, you know, the multi-stage, the final 1v1s. 87 Slayer, that is Kraken's unlock right there. If I do get a task, I probably will go and do it and uh, maybe use the try to myself to go to barrows or i could sell it for like an item you know uh, some type of piece of barrows armor or like a zero staff whatever everyone wants a trident to go you know slave away at barrows before the final hour uh yeah there it is from isles quest complete so i can just afk at yaks um after i do barrows today sit down jad oh yeah fire cape feels so good man it is a lot harder in demo mode but that still you know wasn't too bad imagine getting an infernal cape man within you know the seven days on the tournament that would be insane i know someone could do it out there right so it's about four in the morning and i did manage to get a kraken task but yeah look at that xp 202k hp xp 120k slayer xp per hour 710k mage and we're about to get a magic level as well feeling good yes a trident drop that is what we need right there i've only killed like 25 of these as well sweet okay i'm gonna go sell this for some big bank or like i said actually go use it at barrels if i can't find a you know a juicy trade waterfall quest complete i'm probably gonna go to bed honestly i'm gonna go to bed and uh, tomorrow morning i'm gonna wake up and do the crystal shield quest you know roving elves so that should be a lot of fun i feel like a lot of people train all the way to 99s and oh i just alked my <clears throat> alked my stamina pot or it starts at 1 p.m okay it's about um 22 hours away then I've got it written on my whiteboard, you know what I mean? Can't forget. That'd be so awkward wait, waking up late or, th you know what I mean? Getting the time zones off. What do you guys, what do you guys think? If you were the clan leader, would you split the gold evenly? You said you would split with CC stars. If it was my clan chat, dude, I'd probably split with a lot of you guys. And before I get a 2K split, I'm down with that. I think Fools is going to win, dude. <laughs> I think Fools is going to dominate. As long as I can make it to the 1v1s, I've, I've already, like, I haven't won. But in my mind, I've won. Because that's my goal, just to make it to the 1v1s. I know I'm not going to actually win the tournament. I mean, there's people with full armor. Armado Crossbow, Sarah Godsword, you know what I mean? The whole, the whole clan just camped out the God Wars. Are you guys going to try out the seasonal demo mode? It is a lot of fun. It is a lot of fun to play for one day at least. Swapping is allowed. More people in the game mode, even if they're making money to swap. That means more PKers can actually kill the people, you know, killing green dragons or blue dragons trying to get money to swap. There it is. The quest complete. Roving elves and a crystal shield. I'll probably use this crystal shield up at Barrows for a few hours and try and have it degrade and then come back um, later and buy a whole new one. Look, this guy right here, level 39, that's probably a mule. 
You know what I mean? Because he's not doing anything. He doesn't have any uh, stats trained or anything. All right, let's uh, let's do Barrows, man. I'm gonna get a G-Mall out. I might G-Mall people if I'm feeling it. That mage is better on Carol's than um, melee or range. That just doesn't make sense to me. Because you think it would have high mage defense because it's Carol's armor. Is that strange? How do they actually decide who the winner is on Deadman mode? Uh, it's the dude that freaking wins, man. There's 256 players that actually make it to the 1v1s or whatever. And then, you know, each time they fight, it goes to 128, then 64. Oh my gosh, we just KO'd someone. I wasn't even planning to do it, dude. I just saw him so low. Let's go. First freaking chest. I wasn't even expecting to do that, dude. It just came right to me. The guy was waiting to get killed. 34 Barrows teleports. Damn, that's some loot right there. They're like 25k each. That's a lot of loot. But yeah, check out that uh, looting bag, guys. That is inc that's crazy. 728 Wrath Runes. 1.2 mil PK right there, just in the tabs. And then the broad bolts, everything like that. This is a really good, really good loot. People people were hitting me up on Twitter, commenting on my vid. Ditter, bitter, and fucking wreck you. Why would you call him that? And I was like, bro, it's just it's just friendly jokes, you know? Because his name's Ditter, bitter, ditter, shitter. It's a good one. The only tournament I was planning on doing Lunar Quest. So the fact I can't do Lunars or Pidey, it's a pretty big setback. Also, here's my stats, guys, if you are curious. 92 attack, 95 strength, 92 defense, 91 range, 92 mage, 79 prayer. I was rank one prayer in the game last night. Oh, a one mil key, but not that crazy. This guy's been doing a fuck ton of barrows, dude. 600 limps. Damn. Oh, yo, look at this guy. It's Mika. Freaking nerd, dude. He's got primordial boots. A $32,000 prize really isn't that much. Jagex should do more. What are your thoughts on that? Everyone in the chat, how do you feel about that? Should the, um, should the winning, the winnings be a lot more? Or what do you guys think? I mean, 32K is quite a bit. Although the winner only wins 20,000. That's enough. It's quite a bit, I think. Hey, what's up, Skirt2, King Tedward, and Jace. What's up, man? Appreciate that follow, brother. No, the price is fine. It's a dying game, if not dead. It's definitely not dead, man. It could be a little bit more active, but it's. I think Dead Mode's doing, doing pretty well. Oh, look at this guy right here. This is, dude, this guy is savage. Look at him. He's got a stat hammer and full freaking obsidian. I don't know who would spend the money on that armor. Oh, shit. You see him just attack that guy. He just gave him a clunk. Oh, shit. Don't get hit right here. Um, ooh, he's one HP. I have no prayer. Ooh, 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 ooh. he could hit me big. Did you get Piety and Vengeance? Nah, man. Like 90% of the game still doesn't have it. I went and checked this morning and scouted and they're still there. You should use whatever you're using the finals. This is exactly what I will be using. Like the thing about using the seeds is it moves you one square each time and it wasn't doing that. I would definitely be using the seeds. Trust me. Damn, he caught that. When they catch the freezes, I don't know if I'm like done for in that. Ooh, that would have been juicy, bro. He didn't catch that either. 43 right there. Boom! I could have killed him. Yo, we're doing pretty well. I'm not going to lie. Wow, yo, good fight. We killed him again. Okay, it shows. Yo, I I'm actually kind of happy with this. It shows this inventory. Once I get it down, it actually is better. Okay, this level 98. You guys see this level 98 right here? Look at this guy, dude. He's sitting at 30 HP. This guy is so juicy right here. I want him so bad. Oh, fail that, fail that spec, dude. Oh, the zeros, man. Oh, did anyone catch that? She's, she's sitting so low HP. No! This guy is a living feast right now. He's a living feast. Oh, man. He's, oh, is he trying to DH me? Dude, yo, this guy is a savage. I was gonna G mall you, to be honest. LOL. Yo, the plot twist is real. He was trying to kill me the whole time. Dude, this guy's name is Black Suspect. I feel like that's so racist. Oh, I fucked up so bad. I'm such a pleb, dude. No, no, just G mall the freaking blood worm. I probably will. Um, oh, no, 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 don't hit me, please. He can hit me big. Woo, out of prayer. Oh yeah, this is it. We're getting an item. We're getting a PK. We're getting an item. I mean, just listen to the music. It, tell, it tells us everything we need to know.
Yes! Oh, Vera Brasser PK as well! Yo, that's what I'm talking about! Let's go! So hype, wrecked, yes, dude! Alright, the looting bag is uh, 850k. That's a really good looting bag. We got 500 death runes, 1k chaos, like a full rune set. Varak Brassard as well. I bet he's mad about that one. <laughs> yeah, let's go. But yeah, pretty epic. I would definitely do that, honestly. I do in the normal game, like... Oh, look at Cattails over there. No dancing on the hill. <laughs> Freaking house. Oh, shit. LOL, coming in with the G Mall. <laughs> Savage, bro. Oh, she's in the CC. Fuck, my bad. Oh, man. That default on PK. Imagine that shit, guys. You guys ready for this? Boom! 93 range. Feeling good, feeling good. Oh, my gosh. Let's check out the loot. Can we finally get a Barrows item? Oh, uh, man. 16 chests, bro. Day 7 of the Dead Memo Tournament. There it is, man. I'm feeling really good. 117 combat. And uh, yeah, I'm probably gonna edit this video, upload it, and actually start my stream. So go check that out. We're gonna do the final hour on stream. Take home that 20K, get the win. Feeling good. I will check you guys later.